Hi guys, it's Maaike. Welcome back. Here's part 2 of 3 of finishing my PhD projects half done. In part 1 I said I didn't do the stamp background, the colored ones. I only needed the sentiments and uh, card base. But actually this footage was uh, not as long as I thought <laughs> it was. It just felt longer, I guess. Or maybe I lost some. Hmm. We'll see. My camera got really hot. But that's okay. Um, I missed them that it's. Uh, I also wanted to say I'm just stamping and using products that I have. I'm not mentioning any of them. Um, it's just to show you, you know, ideas, um, what I do. I don't enjoy mass producing very much because I, 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 I'm one card kind of person actually um, <laughs> and yeah I had a bit of trouble with lint I'm using window chamois so that's not lint but um, it's still my style so all in a row they look a bit samey but I tried to use washi tape like here which you probably all have and I have really cute cat print and black cats with <laughs> that I actually use these for my envelopes but I thought it would so cool with my card. I'm using a bit of foil, a bit of glitter, a bit of ink blending, all kinds of things. You know, they still make them different, but still my style. So <laughs> they will look a little bit the same also because I made 600 cats. So, <laughs> and um, yeah, that, that's all I can I want to say. It, it, um, it's just to give you some ideas. It's not about the products I use. If you have them, you can use them, of course, and you can emulate it to your own stash then that's great so thank you for watching and hopefully i'll see you in part three bye